ChatGPT is that one app that I wish I had when I was a student. With this app, you can literally do nearly everything without even leaving your window screen. Hey everyone, it's Eunice. If you like the content of this video, make sure that you are hitting the subscribe button and turn on the notifications to see more videos like this. Right, so what is ChatGPT? Um, it is this AI chatbot basically that has been taught by reading lots of different texts that millions of people have inputted. And this allows ChatGPT to write answers and responses to questions amazingly accurately. And that actually sounds like it's been written by a person. There's literally so much hype out there in the internet about ChatGPT at the moment and I thought oh my gosh it's actually going to be so so helpful for a student and the thing is it's still currently free. Here's a disclaimer though so obviously this is an AI tool and since it's still in its early days especially it needs very specific instructions from the writer yourself to come up with the perfect answers that you're looking for so it still needs quite a lot of guidance from the writer. As a student I would only use it as a catalyst to kickstart your workflow and help you save a lot of time. It is by no means a way to replace your own work or to complete any of your tasks or assignments in one hit. It is not designed to help you do everything because that is just plain cheating and plagiarizing. Right, now that's out of the way, let me tell you how ChatGPT can help you save so much time with your studying. Number one, formatting essays and assignments. ChatGPT can help you write any assignment a lot faster and a lot more effectively. This is because when you first start out it can really help you with providing you with an outline or a wee template and um, suggesting different headings, highlighting like the, the important points that you should include in your essay or assignment. So that can really save you a lot of time. Number two, ChatGPT can help you edit and proofread all your writing. So this software is great because it is able to go into your writing and look at your spelling, your grammar, your punctuation and give you a bit of feedback about what you need to do to improve the quality of your writing. This can save so much time and it's a sure way that you can get your writing up to scratch. How should you do it? You pretty much copy and paste all of your work on your document and chuck it onto ChatGPT and tell it to proofread it. It's that simple. Feature number three. Now this is my absolute favorite feature. ChatGPT can help you do research and any lit reviews a lot faster. This is because it has access to a large, large amount of databases and resources in one click. So you must be thinking, wait, so how does this differ from Google then? The beauty of ChatGPT is that you can do everything that you need in that one setting. Because on Google, you, you input something and it'll come up with all sorts of Google search results and you still have to sift through all of that to find the information that you need. But with ChatGPT, you can just say, hey, list five research papers that provide the evidence I need to back up this statement. And it can just come up with all of that without having to go through Google to look at that. And it can save you some time because you know everyone dreads going to Google Scholar and what a research gate to do their lit reviews so this is a great way to get everything done in one place. Of course like I said because it is an AI tool it is still in its early days you need to make sure that you are always cross-checking with the evidence that you got from ChatGPT to make sure that it is all accurate and legitimate for you to use. Number four ChatGPT can create and generate ideas so quick you know writer's block can be such a struggle I know you feel me on that. I so wish that when I was a student that I had ChatGPT to help me with some of my wide reading um, when it comes to reading a book and coming up with good points to start talking about. So if you're struggling with coming up with ideas for your next project or your next assignment, I strongly suggest that you try out ChatGPT, typing the topic that you're interested in and it will spit out all these um, great ideas that you can then expand yourself if you're interested in those topics. It will save you so much time with your brainstorming. Number five, ChatGPT can be such a useful tool to help you summarize main points from a large volume of text or a research paper that you're after in just simple bullet points. You could literally chuck like the whole page of your lecture slide onto ChatGPT and tell it to summarize it in a couple of points. And I think as a student, this is super helpful because you can also ask ChatGPT to summarize just the main finding, um, main study findings from a research 
page paper because god there's like 10 pages in that one paper and like all the fonts are like this tiny so it's so dreadful to have to read through everything just to find a couple of points that are important for you to use so if you're not doing a lit review and you just want some main findings to back up a few statements this is a great way to use chat gpt Number six, creating flashcards. How amazing is that? So what you would do is you just copy a big body of text um, from your lecture slides again, and then you chuck it onto ChatGPT and say, please create flashcards for me from this body of text. And voila, it comes out. And I have to say, when I first saw this from um, the person who was talking about it on this YouTube channel, and um, I thought it was absolutely ingenious and it will save you a lot of time from creating those anky flashcards. Number seven, ChatGPT can help you write cover letters and CVs. Now I don't know about you but if you were anything like me as a student I absolutely hated doing this part as a student because I always get a wee block like I don't really know where to start I don't really know how to sell myself so ChatGBT can help you with that. It gives you a couple of templates or outlines that you can start off with and these are generally templates that have done really well for and have been successful. The great thing about it is that you can tailor it to the specific type of job or or things that you're trying to apply for you can tell ChatGPT hey look can you please write me a CV that is specifically for applying for medical school or something like that ChatGPT ensures that all your documents your cover letters your CVs your resumes are perfectly error free and super professional so ChatGPT can be an absolutely time saver and a very useful tool if you use it correctly and don't abuse it in the wrong ways. Or else you can really get to shit and like get in a lot of trouble for using it for plagiarism instead of saving you time. Make sure you watch this next video up here on how to become more productive, especially if you're tired. And thanks guys, have a good time.